Today, we are going to be writing the formula for the ionic compound barium bromate. So let's work from left to right. The first thing that I see is barium. I'm going to scan the periodic table to see where barium is. And it looks like barium is all the way down here in group two. Barium is represented by a Ba. And just know that all elements in group two, they're all metals, right? And they all have the same charge of being a plus two. So that's the first thing that I'm going to write. I got barium, Ba, and it's a plus two charge. Now I move over to bromate. I see that it's an ATE ending. And remember, all ATE endings are polyatomic ions. They are never going to be on the periodic table. You have to memorize them. For the sake of the video, I wrote down what bromate was, but just use flashcards, do whatever you got to do to just memorize that bromate is BrO3, and that has a negative one charge. Now we have both components, so we do this little trick where we take the charges and we crisscross them down to see how many of each I need. This plus two crisscrosses down, telling me that I need two bromates, and then this one crisscrosses down, telling me that I just need one barium. When we do this crisscross, don't worry about the charges anymore. We're just looking at the subscripts at the bottom, okay? These are like counting numbers. Don't worry about the positives and the negatives. So now we're ready to write our formula. I got barium, Ba. I only need one of them, so I don't have to write a one here. But here's the thing, guys. If you need multiple polyatomics, in this case, I need two bromates, I need to see it in parentheses. So I have to put parentheses, put the whole polyatomic in the parentheses, which is BrO3, close the parentheses, and now say that I have two of them. And now we are done. So barium bromate is Ba, BrO3, 2. Thank you so much for viewing the video. I really hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. Subscribe if you want to help us out. Like the video. Tell your friends. All right? Thank you, and I will see you in future lessons. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.